Hello, I'm Arielle from Revival Acres, where we're growing a digital feast to revive homes, hearts, and your family's health. Today, I am so excited to be back. It's been a long time. I kind of took a year off for various reasons, but I'm back and we have so many things planned. It's exciting and I can't wait to share all of those things with you. I really just love this curriculum, so I wanna share it with you today. And it is called A Gentle Feast. Here is the teacher's manual. And it is truly Charlotte Mason. It is the best, in my opinion, open and go Charlotte Mason curriculum out there. It is great for families, big families, especially people who want to do Charlotte Mason but are not quite sure what it's about or how to implement it because it can be very, very intimidating because you are offering a feast. A true Charlotte Mason schedule for form one, so that would be first, second, and third grade, you'd offer 10 different subjects in your morning time. I get it, that's a but lot. This, it lays it out so beautifully, so easily, and spreads it throughout your day. So if you are looking to dive into Charlotte Mason, do not know where to start, this curriculum is for you. We did cycle two last year, and so we're moving on to cycle three. You start in the 1800s, and then as you progress in forms, you kind of uh, throw in other streams of history, uh, which is very, very Charlotte Mason. You're studying different streams of history as you get older, and you're going to see how the world all comes together in history. It's a really wonderful and unique uh, history cycling that you do not see a lot, even in Charlotte Mason inspired curriculums, but this one does do it. All right, Julie, the creator, she really put a lot of thought into making this accessible, easily used by families, especially with those with many kids. And I think that is one of the beautiful things about it is it makes it doable to give your children a rich education uh, like Miss Mason would have encouraged you to do, but it's practical and it um, gives you the opportunity to do the whole feast and not feel like you're leaving anything out. So in the beginning, I'll do a flip through at the end. So if you want to just see what's inside of this, I can't show you all of it because that would be against copyright, but I'll show you a few pages. In the beginning, she lays out the different parts of the feast. So you have morning time, breakfast if you want to call it, the beginning appetizer, <laughs> and then you go into the main feast and then you have dessert in the afternoon. That's how Julie has laid it out. And in the beginning of this manual, she tells you step by step what each course means. So there should be no questions, but if you have questions, head on to the Facebook group and people there are super helpful. There's a whole section on narration. So if you're new to Charlotte Mason, and I could do another video on this if you want, it's intimidating. What is narration? How do you do narration? Who does narration? Written narration? Verbal narration? <laughs> What's dictation? There's some terms that you definitely want to familiarize yourself with. So she does have a section in the back of this to help you with that. This is Cycle 3, Teacher's Manual, A Gentle Feast, Reforms, Revolutions, and Reconstructions. And as you'll see, that there is a cycle of history, but as your student progresses through the forms, they will add different streams of history in alongside your form one who is learning American history. So you'll still be learning this along with these various other streams of history. That is true Charlotte Mason purist because of her streams of history. All right, I'm just gonna show you a few pages. Like I said before, beautiful inside. This describes her forms. She is a little different than Charlotte Mason. I think she does this in order to be able to uh, make it better for large families. Like I said, it's a very practical curriculum as far as Charlotte Mason open and go. And then she tells you the different parts of the feast and breaks them down and it's just littered with quotes from Charlotte Mason. Then I wanted just to show you The dessert, this would be the afternoon. Now in true Charlotte Mason, this dessert would be in your morning because Charlotte Mason was done by uh, form one, you're done by like 11, 11.30. So Julie has broken it up so that you do some of the arts kind of subjects in the afternoon. And I think that is again, 
how she can make it open and go for large families. Then you just have a few extra pages you can work with. So you'll begin each term with a new memory verse, and then each week we'll begin with your morning time, which I'll show you the inside of that as well if you choose to buy the uh, printed version. Again, she has language arts packets that would correspond beautifully to her curriculum if you choose to do that. If not, then you would just skip this. Each week, you'll have the subjects and then each form, what is asked of them during the week. And this allows you the freedom to break up the days as you see fit, your schedule. Um, and there are sample schedules in the back, but this is very flexible. And that's why I love it because it's practical for the modern day Charlotte Mason, but staying true as she can to the method. And then your tea time, like I said before, are some of the extras uh, that would have been in the morning time of uh, the PE use, but this way allows for moms to fit it in and homeschool many students and have it open and go. And then you can, if you're gonna cycle through, this is a great thing to just write a portion. And then the next time you open this cycle, uh, you know, four years from now, you'll have some great insight as to how it went. And like I said before, each week begins and looks like that. Now in the back of this manual, there are more helpful tidbits. So here is a five day schedule, how you could break it up. And then she also includes a four day schedule. And this is for every form she does this to help you understand. I would say if you're able to stick to the five day, I think you'll get the most out of any Charlotte Mason curriculum if you stick to the five day because there is 10 plus subjects that you're trying to fit in. And to get the beauty of Charlotte Mason, you have to be doing school, um, I think, five days. All right, she tells you the Charlotte Mason assessment and what that looks like. It's very different than modern day assessment. Samples. Then just different notes and a form that you can use to help you. And it goes through explaining narration as well. If you're new to narration, this is very helpful. And then it ends with a quote. This is cycle three, morning time, and this is the printed version. You can purchase only the digital if you choose, just like with a teacher's manual. I like buying the morning time printed because you get the artwork already printed beautifully for you and you don't have to worry about your printer um, not doing it justice. So in the morning time, again, it's meant to look like the teacher's manual of the cycle. Gives a little description of what is morning time. So in Charlotte Mason, these morning time subjects would have been scattered in throughout your morning and you would just do all your school in the morning. She has split it up to make it a whole family experience so that you can have an open and go Charlotte Mason curriculum uh, for your whole family. And that's why she splits it up the way she does. And then like in the teacher's manual, you'll have your term one Bible memory and she encourages you to do this in the morning time and that's why it's here. And this is what your schedule looks like up close. I've just marked off some things because I'm not doing all the forms. So I just put a sticky note over so it wasn't distracting to my eye. And then it shows you each week what you will be doing. We're not doing Bible, that's her Bible rotation. We're doing a true Sam Bible rotation, so I just covered that up. But here is the bread and butter of the forms. All your hymns are printed out for you uh, that you'll be doing in your morning time, which is wonderful. And then all your recitations for every form is ready to go. Now in the digital, these will be printed on separate pieces of paper that you can add to your students' workbooks or morning menus, and they have little artworks on them. But for the mom, this is fantastic. It's all ready to go. Then you also have your beautiful pictures and then a picture of the artist and composer as well to show your students. And it's printed on this heavy um, gloss paper which is why I love getting the printed. And then you also have all your poetry that you will be reciting for all your forms. 
right here, ready to go, which I really appreciate. And this is for the whole term. And then you'll move on. See at the bottom, term one, poetry, and then term two, and everything will be there for term two, organized beautifully, and then so on until you get to form, or excuse me, term three. And then as you'll see, each of the recitations and speeches are split up by form to make it easy for you. So like I said, it's the best open and go Charlotte Mason uh, curriculum out there that follows her history cycle. She offers this along with the digital. The digital, I think, is, this is beautiful, but the digital is gold. It's so workable. Everything is in Excel spreadsheets, the book list, the schedule per form, broken down for every six weeks that you can print out for your form and edit it and change it. Every it's, it's so workable and I love that. And I think it's super helpful, especially if you need to adjust things to fit your family or you have a big family and you just need like print it out six weeks at a glance for every student or give it to your student as they get older and say, this is your work. <laughs> this is what's expected of you. Let's do it together. Check it off as you get done, however you want to do it. So the digital is $80. If you want the manual and the digital, I believe it's <laughs> 120. I think that's what it is. And you'll get this in the mail, but then you'll get access to the digital files as well. And there's like a whole area, membership area on her website. And then again, the Facebook group is super informative. Like I said, this is the best open and go Charlotte Mason curriculum that I have seen. There are a few tweaks to the uh, Charlotte Mason p &EU schedule. I think Julie did a wonderful job though to keep it true to the principles of Charlotte Mason, but practical for the modern family. And like I said, I've gone through so many curriculums, <laughs> more so than I needed to, as you've probably seen on my channel, but I'm happy to do it in order to help and serve others to choose what's best for their family. But as far as Charlotte Mason goes, this is the easiest, closest Charlotte Mason open and go that I've seen. Mm -hmm.